Meantime, Myron May was in Albuquerque as recently as September. He was taking legal classes here. Yeah, and even then, some staffers say they noticed some concerning behavior. Action 7 News reporter Kristen Swanson is here with that part of the story. Good morning, Kristen. Good morning, Todd Marissa. The head of the state bar says no one noticed any aggressive behavior from May. Instead, they described feelings more like fear or paranoia. Staffers say May's attendance was erratic. He'd leave the program, come back, and then leave again. They were so concerned they referred him to a counselor. After that, he left for good. He did cause some attention. We did do follow up with him, and he assured our counselors that he was okay. Uh, and then he left the state. Um, and it's very scary to think that uh, we were that close to something like this. The last time the bar heard from May was when he informed them he was going to Florida. Conti says he wishes there was something the bar could have done to help May. And he says there were no reports he ever tried to hurt anyone during his time here in Albuquerque. Back to you.